Hey guys, welcome to another product showcase video. Uh, this product is from uh, the people at Noctua, and this is the NF-P14FLX fan. Okay, first thing we're going to do is have a look at the package itself. Let's see if we can adjust down here a little bit. A um, little different uh, colored package than uh, the other ones I've seen from Noctua. Usually they have like a blue and a brown packaging. Uh, I don't know if this is a new style of box or just something that they have uh, are doing just on this fan. But anyway, on the front of the box it has the part number itself as well as information about the Vortex control notches, metal reinforcement, round frame, three speed settings, SC Drive 2, and their SSO bearing, as well as a link to their website itself. On the back side of the box, we have the typical um, Noctua box where they just put a ton of information on here. Um, information about the fan itself, uh, different stuff about the speed controls, the bearing, and the typical fold-out that you normally see with Noctua. Uh, they almost should charge just an extra five dollars just for the box and their fans just because of the wonderful information they provide um, telling you everything you could ever want to know about the fan itself before you've even purchased it. Uh, they do a super job telling you all the specs and stuff on it. But uh, that pretty much covers the box. Let's open it up and uh, see what you get with it. Okay, in the box you get the fan itself, of course. Um, a couple of their uh, power connectors. This is your uh, low noise and your ultra low noise connectors to speed the fan down. It comes with a Molex connector in case you don't want to plug it into your motherboard or a fan controller. You can plug it right into your power supply with the Molex. It comes with four of their rubber, uh, or neoprene, I believe they are, anti-vibration mounts, four of your standard uh, fan mounting screws, and four uh, adapters to adapt this fan to a 140 millimeter uh, fan mount. Okay, let's take a closer look at the fan itself. Um, one first thing you'll notice is the unique round design that they have on this fan. The, the reason they did that is so you could fit a 140 uh, millimeter fan into a 120 millimeter mount, uh, so you can really move some air with it. I'm going to grab a standard fan here just to give you an idea. The way they did it was by rounding the fan itself. If we line up the uh, mounting holes here, you can see how the fan extends on all four sides, um, larger than the uh, standard 120 millimeter, so you can really move some air with it. With them including brackets that I showed you, you can also mount this into a 140 millimeter fan hole if you uh, want to. Let's see if we can get a good look at the fan blades themselves. And you'll notice the notches that are on the fan blades. That's part of their vortex control. Uh, notches. What they do is uh, basically break up the airflow coming through in different spots on each blade. And what that does is deaden the noise that the fan makes because of breaking it up into different frequencies that each frequency is less noticeable than having it all running at one frequency at a real loud speed. Uh, that's why most of your cheaper fans end up being so noisy is because they're they're all operating at one frequency and it, it tends to be very annoying so it's a really uh, nice design once again this is their uh, metal reinforced bearing shell and it has some weight to it as you'll notice with all Noctua fans they are quite heavy they're very well built uh, more so than any of the cheaper just plastic ones that I've seen uh, this again comes with one of their long uh, connectors. Let me grab a tape measure. I'll tell you just how long it is. It's 
about 16 inches long, so that should be long enough to reach to anywhere on your motherboard, as well as uh, to a fan controller or wherever you might want to connect it. Uh, this thing is uh, their three-speed flex technology, of course, so as I showed you with them adapters, you can just plug in the adapter to the end of the uh, fan itself and then plug the other end into your power source, be it your Molex fan controller or uh, right to the motherboard itself. The RPMs on this at uh, stock speeds without any adapters is 1200 RPM. When you use the low noise adapter that drops it down to 900 RPM and with the ultra low adapter it'll drop it down to 750 RPM. Uh, this has their patented SSO bearing which is very quiet and gives it very long life. This carries Noctua's six-year warranty. Uh, that's just an amazing amount of time to warranty a fan, considering the wear and tear that they take and all. Uh, this has an airflow stock without the adapters of 110.3 meters per hour. With low noise adapter, it is 83.7 uh, meters per hour and with the ultra low adapter it's 71.2 meters per hour so it's uh, even on its lowest setting it's moving as much air as some of your uh, higher end 120 millimeters do on high and at that speed you're guaranteed to almost not hear it at all uh, as a matter of fact the acoustic noise decibels on it without the adapters are 19.6 which is already pretty low at full speed uh, with the uh, low noise adapter that drops down to 13.2 and with the ultra low adapter uh, 10.1 so a very quiet fan operates on 12 volts uh, input power of 1.2 watts and this has a uh, lifespan of 150,000 hours that's just an amazing length of time for a fan I really like the uh, round design, the fact that they uh, did design it to fit into a 120 millimeter mount is awesome, so right out of the box you can bolt it right into your case without having to use the adapters or anything, the ones that are on it are your 120 millimeter. A very unique design, uh, traditional colors for your Noctua fan, your uh, brown and tan color very well made. You can really tell just by feeling it how heavy it is and how well built it's been. But I'm looking forward to trying this in the case. I'm going to put this in a new case that I'll be having coming and uh, test it out and I'll let you know what I think about it. But I think it's uh, going to be a very nice product. Something you should definitely look into if you're going to buy a 120 millimeter fan. Uh, definitely look at this one. You're not going to find one that's bigger or probably flows as much air as this one does. So we want to thank Noctua for providing this product for our showcase. Once again, this is their NF-P14FLX 140mm fan. Thank you for watching.